gentlemen, presenting Sam Mills for enshrinement into the Pro Football Hall of Fame, Melanie Mills and Jim Bora. Thank you, everyone. You've already heard a lot of statistics, but today I want to talk to you about the humanity of one man. On the surface, the Sam Mills story is a story of a man who was told that he wasn't good enough, good enough to play college football, or that he wasn't big enough to play professional football. And at the age of 27, he wasn't young enough for the NFL. And yet, here we are today, celebrating him. That's because Sam worked harder than his peers. He took advantage of every opportunity. He became a legendary athlete. But he never forgot he was just a man. Sam treated everyone with respect and dignity they deserve. He visited his mother and siblings in New Jersey as often as he could. He kept his friends from high school and college, and he made new friends at his cancer treatments. He talked to everyone, and I mean everyone. He told dad jokes and loved pr childish pranks. I don't recall him ever saying no to an autograph, a picture, or a handshake. He knew the staff at the practice facilities and the stadiums. He'd sneak away and visit people that he barely knew in the hospital. He made it to his kids' high school football games, track meets, and band competitions. He'd go bowling with anyone who asked. He would ask about your day, and he would listen because he cared. From the Philadelphia Stars, to the New Orleans Saints, to the Carolina Panthers, if you were working hard at anything, Sam would let you know he appreciated your hard work. You could be a teammate, a coach, a ball boy, a security guard, he would make you feel seen. It's no wonder that Sam inspired so many people or that the Panthers adopted his motto, keep pounding. Sam was always ready to show you what hard work looked like. He led by example and people followed. He was more than just a great football player. He was a father, a friend, a husband and a leader who always kept pounding, no matter what the odds were. So thank you for this honor, for believing in Sam, and for helping to keep his story alive. Keep pounding, everyone. That's what Sam would want you to do.